Hello there everyone. Uh, this one-shot build is um, extremely bizarre. Uh, so what uh, you'll notice here is that we're obviously running Queenslayer, Queen Slayer, but uh, in the light of certain events here that we've been going through in the road to 100 with uh, investigating light scaling and bridge to glory and weapons and um, so on and so forth here with uh, bonuses and benefits and everything, uh, I wanted to kind of explain uh, kind of what's going on here with this one shot and why it's kind of actually amazing. Uh, so we will not be using a communal um, with any of our uh, friends. This will be a straight up one shot uh, shot here with uh, with a sword and uh, we need Louie to come along as he is one of the uh, many gears here in this uh, cogworks that we've got running here as there are so many moving parts that if any one thing is off like if Louis doesn't give us his overdrive stack, then we can't get the kill. If one of these cartridges runs out, we can't get the kill. If one of these buffs runs out on the elements, we can't get the kill. If we forget to equip, um, uh, if we forget to equip swift destruction, we can't get the kill. If we don't get the charge attack from the Fullman blade, we can't get the kill. If we um, don't have the intensified daybreak thunderfang, uh, it's the same as the uh, fortified. But that value of 1568, if we have anything lower than that, we can't get the kill. Uh, if we don't uh, do things in a very specific order here of how our uh, buffs go up, we can't get the kill. So I will, um, I will show, uh, first of all, the kill here if everything goes well. And then we'll uh, investigate a little more about some of the options. So uh, I can't talk and do this order at the same time, so apologies for that. So uh, go ahead and enjoy the show, and you'll hear me muttering in the background, so just kind of ignore that. Uh, but then we'll go through it, kind of what's going on here and why this is uh, kind of my personal favorite of the one-shots, since I don't have to use a communal, but I still need Louie along for the ride. Uh, so, okay, here we go. There, I messed it up. I messed it up. I messed it up. Oh, apologies. Okay. Uh, so, why I messed it up? Because I have to do the charge attack before uh, Flashing Fang and uh, Blow of Madness, as that will uh, be, uh, prompt an automatic restart here. Okay, so I will, um, I will uh, give this another shot here. Okay. Uh, and I need to... Okay, we're ready to go. That's a solid start. We can get it now. Okay. There we go. Um, menuing is hard. Oh, we're not going to get it. Uh, lightning damage wore out. Okay. So you'll see that this is very, 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 very finicky. Um, it is not uh, by any means uh, for the faint of heart to actually pull this off. Uh, you gotta have a crazy mind like mine uh, in order to just uh, kind of think through it here. Uh, so bear with me, and we will uh, we will absolutely get this. Uh, as you can see, I've been in the arena a little bit here, um, and it works. Uh, it's just a uh, convoluted mess here. Okay, so let's do this. This. That's a solid start. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do this. gave us his stack of overdrive okay. and if she plays nice there we go now Louie did hit her um, for a little bit there um, whew, I'm, I'm nervous about that uh, so Louie did hit her there but um, it truly is a straight-up one-shot 
uh, even if he doesn't um, hit her at all. Uh, and I will show you here now that if we don't do the 5% or 5.5, 6% charge uh, damage attack from the Fulman Blade, um, it's not a one shot. She has a tiny bit of sliver of health left, and uh, you can't actually get the one shot. And then we'll look at the stats and everything along the way. Okay. And we'll do this. And so we're not going for the uh, charge attack this time. So we can just uh, go straight up for these. And we can switch this to Swift Destruction. Okay. And we have enough in, in being at 7 uh, I Core to have um, Steadfast Strike. And Louis gave us his, um, his stack there. See? And right there, that little bit of the charge attack is uh, what makes it not a one-shot kill. Um, so if any, if any one little thing here is not active, um, it, uh, it just doesn't work. And uh, <laughs> it's so amazing that uh, that charge attack from the Fulman Blade, uh, or it doesn't have to be the Fulman Blade, but it could be um, the uh, Azure Greatsword, the Brionac, the Blood Mist, the Sharur, or the um, or the Bloody Snow, but the Bloody Snow is six I core and it's not worth it. Uh, the Fulman Blade is only two I core to cost you, and so it uh, it definitely um, doesn't break. So uh, if we go for um, everything here, we will look at uh, what our um, stat is on the blade itself. So we go for the Fortified to have the highest base with the highest scaling simultaneously at the same time. Uh, we don't go for the gifts uh, because the 50% multiplier increase is not significant enough to outweigh um, the higher base damage from the scaling that's taken away. Um, it's just not worth it, uh, unfortunately, but uh, that's, that's the case of what it is. So if we go uh, and power up here, uh, we'll see exactly um, what we what we land on. Okay, we'll do this. And uh, it doesn't really matter now since we're right next to the missile, but uh, we can go ahead. I mean, Swift Destruction won't show up on the card, but you can kind of imagine. And now if we look at the uh, card here, we're at over 10,000, uh, 10,177, and a whole bunch of uh, element uh, buffs there that are running out as you see and the uh, blood uh, the blood um, damage there was um, sig significantly higher from the uh, blood uh, cartridge but when you do the blood weapon it's still the same 50 um, as you would normally have and she is weak to blood uh, but this is a lot more fun to uh, get it right to the bloody edge here of uh, exactly what is possible in a one shot so um, yeah, that's a, that's a lot of fun. So you get uh, the 50% bonus to your uh, light value from Final Journey, which you then uh, add that into your Bridge to Glory value, which then gets uh, added um, your, let's see, 250 and 200 times a half. So 350 uh, added here from uh, Survival Instinct, but with the 50% bonus from final journey so everything's adding together here in a big way um, to uh, make sure that this is an actual one shot so thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoy this one shot as it is uh, right at the edge and like I said we're not using a communal and that's what makes it so interesting in my book is that uh, we don't need the other partner uh, for anything other than just that simple overdrive stack that really gives us so hope you enjoyed that and we'll see you in the next one